Hey, I'm and I'm making a video of what I'm up to. So I put this back on. This is the one that was on here before. I just put it back on. I put this tape here just to hold it in place for now so it doesn't slide off because I had to disconnect this area here. And I'm going to disconnect it on, well, I'm going to do something different on this side. But the thing is, is that, as you can see here, here's the box. If I'm looking straight at it, you can see that this sticks out significantly farther on this side. And, I mean, the thing down here, this edge here, sticks out a lot farther than this edge here. So what my plan is, I, I do want them to line up. I know they don't have to, but I want them to line up so there's no restricted airflow. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to pull this out this way so that it lines up with this. And then... Um, and then I'll put a, a, a corner piece to go over it like that way to cover up that hole in the corner. And as far as this area goes here, um, I want this to come out this far as well on this side. So what my plan with this is I'm going to cut this at an angle here. Maybe not along this line, but at an angle. Down this way. And then I'm gonna fold this part out so that it sticks out when it, so the part that I cut at an angle, I'm gonna fold it out and then it'll stick out like this way as far as it needs to, to be lined up with this thing here. And of course that'll leave, um, um, I was kind of thinking of doing the same thing with the other side, but I already disconnected this. So I'm going to figure out what to do here, but um, that'll leave like a little triangle here. Anyway, I'll probably cut it off. But um, I mean, but but I'm going to piece a piece in here that that goes all the way down to where it connects here, and I'm going to use portions of this material here to make those pieces out of. And right now, um, as you can see on this side, before I go into anything further, uh, this comes pretty close to lining up with that. It's about an inch off or three fourths of an inch. So I'm just gonna leave it like that and, and you know, kind of make the piece that connects from here to there go at a little bit of an angle coming out when I get to that point. But, um, yeah, uh, so there is this boot thing that I have. This was originally one piece, and it had a piece of metal going across here, like that way. Anyway, this used to be the metal that was on there. It, it spanned, spanned all the way from here to there, and it covered this, but, but I took it off. And the reason I took it off is because uh, this boot, the hole wasn't big enough. The boot originally sat like this, upward I guess. And then, so it had a hole that was exactly this big. This area was the hole here where you see this little serrated looking edge and it came along this. Anyway, it's a lot smaller than this. So I did some measuring and I found that if I turn it on its side like this way, the 
um, it'll be better. So what I did, uh, this is going to go on. Both of these are going to be together when I put it on, obviously. But it's going to go on right here, like this way. And they're going to be connected like that. And it's going to be like that on the other side with the other piece. And then I have a two inch gap in the middle. And that is what this is for. So that'll at least give me, that'll at least give me the undercurve part of this here where it curves up. And as you can see, it only goes part of the way up. As you can see, it only goes a portion of the way up. So I'll have to make uh, another piece for this top area here that connects directly up to this other piece here. So I'm going to have to piece some things together, but I think it'll be fine. And so this is about where it needs to be, two inches apart. I don't know if this is exactly two inches, but this is going to be two inches, and that's what this piece is here. Now this piece I've been working on, this hole in here, from here to here, is two inches. And so I took the metal, bent it back, and then bent it that way, and this one, on this side, I bent it this way, and then this line here is going to bend back this way, going all the way across. And I will slide the edge of the metal on the inside. This uh, will go, I'm going to have to bend it when I get it down there, but this is going to go here, like so. Just like that, and then... Uh, the edge of this metal is going to slide into this groove here and it'll only go as far as the two inch line so that'll leave me two inches on the middle and that'll get me the bottom area of the boot and um, I have this piece here which is a Z and that's what this was originally attached to this piece with. Uh, when I took it off, I took it off and this Z came off with it. So that's the same Z. It'll be two inches too short, but I don't think that'll be a big deal. I'm going to attach it, um, use that to slide these two together. And that'll give me um, an attachment to hold it in place on the one side. Anyway, I didn't get the screws yet because Bombagars was closed today. So this is basically where I'm at right now. Just wanted to give you an update.